Moving on to the situation in Haiti, where armed gangs are seeking to oust the country's Prime Minister Ariel Henry. The U.S. State Department responding to claims that Washington was trying to persuade the Haitian Prime Minister to resign has said that this is not the case. Rather, the State Department spokesperson said on Wednesday it's calling for Henry to expedite the transition to an empowered and inclusive governance structure that will move with urgency to help the country prepare for a multinational security support mission. The mission, backed by the United Nations but stalled for months, would aim to address the nation's security situation and pave the way for free and fair elections. The comments come after the Miami Herald had earlier reported that U.S. officials called Henry mid-flight when he was returning to Haiti via the U.S. to persuade him to step aside.